What's up guys, so we are working with Sony Pictures Entertainment on the movie Eat, Pray, Love, which comes out August 13th, stars Julia Roberts. So we're very excited about this, we've got a complete line of Eat, Pray, Love packages with trips to Italy, India, and Bali. As part of that, the promotion that we're going to do, we've got a cardboard standee like you guys see when you go to the grocery store or the movie theaters to help promote the film. So we've got one for all of the stores, and they're going to be shipped to you within the next couple of days. So here's an idea of what you guys are going to find in the box. Couple of days. So here are the pieces you're going to find in the box. We've got two white feet. Now these will have double-sided tape on it, which is adhered on one side to the foot and then is covered on the other side. So this is very sticky stuff. Do not take it off before you are ready to put it on the standee. So you have two of these in the box. If you don't have two of these, let us know. Then you'll have three acrylic brochure holders. So you guys will be getting an Eat, Pray, Love booklet talking all about the great product that we have in our partnership with the film. So you'll be able to put these in these acrylic holders and these will be attached to the standee. So you should have three of these in your box. If they're cracked, if they're missing the double-sided tape with the adhesive, please let us know and we'll get you some new ones before you start to put it together. Then you'll find this piece. This is going to be the front of your standee. So you'll notice the creative similar to what we've got on the booklets with the die cut of the city in the background. So this is the first piece of the standee. The second piece will be folded and scored. This is the back, so it's about six feet, six foot four. So it's pretty tall. So for shipping purposes, it's scored, so you'll have to unfold it and put it together. So this will probably be the piece that you want to put together first, and we'll talk about that in just a second. So this is your back to the front piece. Okay guys, so this is the back piece, so make sure you get two people in your store to help you put this together, because this is really sticky double-sided tape that we'll be using as the adhesive, so if you screw it up, it's a lot of, lot of mess there. So make sure that you get two people so that you get it right the first time. So we're going to show you guys how to put together the back piece first. So we're going to lay it down like this. You'll see it'll probably come unfolded and scored as I showed in the past. Um, explanation. So you'll just want to fold it together. So you're basically looking at a really tall rectangle. It's very, very skinny. This one edge is going to have two lines of double-sided tape that extend the entire way on the board. So what you'll want to do is have one person on this side folding together the piece and then another person to take off the piece. So you take off both sides at once, and then you'll want one person at one end of the standee to make sure it's aligned. So it's going down to that end, and then one person at the end. So you want to make sure that the edges align so that this isn't wobbly when you stand it up. Olivia's attaching it on that end, so then she can move her way down as soon as she's got that done. And I'll hold up and make sure that we get all the pieces in line. This will be the front of your standee. So you're basically going to do the same thing as you did with the back piece. So we're going to lay this down. We'll have Olivia on one side. I'll be on the other. You want to make sure that it's pre-folded so you don't have any issues with pulling it together at the end. So we'll take off the adhesive here. Got both pieces off. 
Be careful on the die cut at the top so that you don't mess up some of the, uh, the small cuts in there. So be very careful when you move around that. So you want to do the same thing, have one person at the top and one person at the bottom. And then align it and then move from one end to the other to make sure that you don't have any misalignments along the way. So once you got that together, you've got your front and your back piece. Okay, so you've got your back piece and you got your front piece put together. Now there's going to be double-sided tape on the back of your piece here. So once you make sure that both pieces are level, you want to stand them up and align them together. Then you want to take off the tape off of this front piece. Then so take off the tape. Then you want to make sure again that you're as you're pulling it together that you've got it aligned not only on the floor but then vertically as well. And then you want to push these two pieces together and make sure at the top and the bottom they align so that you've got one solid piece that's stuck together on both sides. So when you have your feet here, these have the double sided tape, two slices, two stripes on the side. So you want to do these one at a time because both people need to work on, on each side of that. So we'll go to the, this side first. Get the adhesive strip off of here. Okay. So you want to make sure again that your piece, which should still be aligned because of the double sided tape, you want to make sure that you got it laying flat. So Olivia's going to go over there and stand on that side and hold it flush so that I can make sure that I'm getting both of these pieces with the tape. So then after you've taken off your double sided tape, I'll be pushing on this side, Olivia will be pushing on that side, so you've got enough pressure there to make sure that this tape, which is really adhesive, will stick together. So that's the first foot, then we'll do the same thing with the second foot. You want to make sure that you're doing this piece, this part while this piece is standing up so you make sure it's level. We don't want this falling over. So now Olivia will go to the other side and hold that piece in. And I'll make sure these are aligned. Push this together. And then Olivia will push on that side and make sure that the adhesive sticks. So there's your feet. of these acrylic folders to hold the booklets that you guys will be getting. So these have double-sided tape on them as well. You want to take that tape off. And the first one that you place, you want to align this opening here in the acrylic the bottom part here with the top of this die. So you want to make sure that your piece is stable and you'll want to align the first one towards the right side. And then apply pressure so that the acrylic sticks to the back. And then you've got two more of these to do. So this Louis are taking the adhesive off of here. So you'll just want to align these. Now we've got the third one. Attach all three here. You want to make sure that you apply a little bit of pressure, pushing downward, 
on these acrylic pieces to make sure that they're stable. And you won't want to pack these with brochures. Put maybe three, four, five brochures per slot on each. If you put any more than that, it might weigh down the piece and pull these off. So once you have everything assembled, you're pretty much good to go. You can place this inside your store. Um, you can place it near the door and it shouldn't fall over. But I would strongly recommend that you keep it inside, not only due to possible weather or wind, um, but just to make sure that nobody takes this awesome, awesome piece. So um, if you guys have any questions, please feel free to contact Olivia or I, call us or send us an email and we'll help you out with instructions.